After six nights of family fun, it was time to head out on our own for a while. With all of the smoke from 20 plus wildfires burning in Oregon, we had to change our initial plans of visiting a friend near Bend and exploring the John Day and Columbia Gorge areas. And really, the only option was to head to the coast with all the other thousands of travelers and RVers. So we headed west, along a highway I hadn't traveled before, out through Lebanon and Corvallis, and along the windy coastal range road to Newport. Every collapse that came to pass faded out of your memory. All of the times he left you blind shaded down on your aching. At this point, we were pretty much winging it, with no plans. We knew we could head back inland for harvest host stays over the Labor Day weekend, but wanted a little coast and water time. Well, everyone else in Oregon had the same idea. Full campgrounds. There are a lot of mom and pop RV parks along the coast, but being eight feet away from a trailer that hasn't moved in six months, well, that just isn't our style. I had done a lot of research before heading out this way, and we did have a few campgrounds on our list of possibilities. One of my favorite parts of this coastline are these beautiful bridges. Years ago when visiting family here, I used to drive out to the coast just to see them. Oh, and have a little fun exploring the tourist and often kitschy little beach towns. The harbors and break walls are amazing. I can't even imagine coming in and out of this in our boat. In addition to those beautiful bridges, Oregon's famous for its rocky coastline. After finding Tillicum Campground full, we headed down to Cape Perpetua. The Moon Camping Guide gave this campground a scenic rating of 8. Again, we look for campgrounds, something scenic, pretty, not chock-a-block RV parks. Cape Perpetua was perfect. We got set up in this very green site and could hear the creek trickling below. See our link above for our campground favorite video on this campground. It was green, it was pretty, it was quiet, and had some water for the dog. You died a little inside when nobody heard your call. Every mistake you come to make grows and echoes inside your brain. You need to let them go. Shot down. We did a little hiking on their beautifully groomed trails. And someone, well, someone did a lot of relaxing. Next up, we head north along the coast to a Thousand Trails campground at Pacific City. If you've enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't already done so, subscribe for more camping videos.